All right, you guys, welcome back to my channel. My name is Maria, and I am a tarot reader here on YouTube. And I'm going to be doing the monthly readings, monthly love readings for the month of July. And if you guys want to go ahead and cross watch for any other sign, go ahead and check out my channel. Um, let's see what else. Anyways, I think that's it, you guys. Um, and this is going to be Scorpio's reading. So let's go ahead and see what is going on with Scorpio for the month of July. I hope that you guys are doing awesome. I am doing wonderful. Just enjoying my Friday. Enjoying my uh, four day weekend. I got yesterday and I own, and um, the whole weekend off, so so I'm pretty pretty happy just taking some me time and doing your guys's videos. So let's go ahead and see what's going on with the collective, guys. I love my piercings. Gotta show them off, man. <laughs> Anyways, okay. So it says, pay attention to the red flags. Hmm. It says the signs are cautioning you. I'll show them, I'll show them to you guys. I just um I'm just I'm pulling them out real quick. And then we have deception. It says someone is wearing a false self mask in this relationship. It says love yourself. And then it says retreat. There's retreat. It says it's time to disconnect from the world. Oh. Scorpio, right off the bat, like, I am feeling like, um, sorry guys. Anyways, there we go. Just, just like that. <laughs> um, I'm feeling like, there's some stuff that is definitely happening. Um, it says, uh, pay attention to the red flags. The signs are cautioning you. And it says deception. Someone is wearing a false self mask in this relationship. And, and then it says, love yourself first. Your self-respect makes you more romantically attractive. there's some to see maybe um, I feel like this is past energy um, Scorpio I feel like maybe there was some things that people were doing and um, they probably like hurt your feelings and you know did some like really deceiving stuff maybe like even cheated on you and um, they weren't being like 100% honest with you um like maybe you just wish that they would have been honest with you because you really really cared for this person and maybe when all this was like unraveling it's like you knew it's like you knew but you didn't want to like accept it and um maybe right now you're just like learning you're you're like leaving that alone you're leaving this relationship alone I feel like you're not with them anymore um, and right now the best thing that you can do is just like retreat it says it's time to disconnect it's time to disconnect from the world so just oh, I feel like this is a sad read I don't know like a little bit of sad but um, it's okay, you know, these things happen to us, Scorpio. And at the end of the day, um, things happen. And time heals, right? Time heals everything. 
and you know take that time to like retreat and love yourself learn to love yourself don't be jumping from relationship to relationship because that is something that Scorpio tends to do that I it's a pattern that I see with a lot of my Scorpio friends um, they're hurting and they're just like they'll like try to like ignore their feelings and try to start something new like real quick and honestly that's not the best like coping um, it's not the best coping um, method right um, it's better to like just enjoy your own energy and heal and blossom and love yourself and put yourself together again so that next time you know that comes around where you know you're all healed um, you're able to go ahead and give a hundred percent of yourself and I, I have this shirt that I just got um, and it's a Tupac shirt and I would show it to you guys but it just came up it just came to my head but it said um, it says follow your heart but but take your brain with you I feel like sometimes in love you know they say love is blind sometimes love can be very blinding um, yes it can be but you know always take your logic with you you know, you have to pay attention to the red flags. If they're right there in front of you and this person and people are being deceiving, like, you just need to retreat. Get away from them because, like, you already know, you know. Sorry, you guys. Like, my mouth is, like, I talk a lot, so. That was bomb. Anyways, um, that's what I'm getting. And that was just based off those Oracle deck cards, you guys. I'm going to go ahead and um, I was going to take the spicy deck, but I'm not. I'm actually not. I'm going to take, I'm going to take this deck, the original tarot. Um, yeah. See, you guys, you guys need to work on, like, on yourselves. Work on being better, on being grounded, on not fucking taking bullshit from nobody. If someone is going to come at you, they need to come, come at you correctly. Or don't come at all, you know? Like, because that's some BS right there. Um, love yourself and don't let people mess with you, Scorpio. You know, our time, we're not getting any younger. Our time is very valuable. So learn, learn to know your self-worth so that people don't be stepping on you, Scorpio. I know that you guys are ruled a lot by your emotions and um, you guys feel a lot like on a like deeper level than it you know other um, zodiac signs so it's very intense when you hurt but you know you gotta think logical sometimes you gotta shut off your feelings and just you know think logical all right what is the energy that Scorpio needs to embody any special messages um, anything that Scorpio needs to know Yeah, so you guys, you guys got the Ace of Swords. Ace of Swords represents clarity, clarity of mind, of taking control, of being strong in your power with your words and not budging. Not budging for anybody, for anybody or anything. Yes. Yep, and you guys got the King of Pentacles. You guys also got the page of wands the page of wands is an energy it could be um the wands do represent the zodiac signs of um the fire signs so the fire signs are leo sagittarius and aries so this is a very like young the page is very young he you know when we're young we're so retarded we just want to be you know fucking 
doing stupid shit not really like we're not really thinking about the bigger picture right then this person is like hot and cold so this person that you're dealing with feels hot and cold towards you maybe they give you some attention and then they like back out they're in and out in and out in and out but honestly scorpio i feel like yes they did make you happy because we do have all these uh, cups right here and these represent emotions but it's not the ten of cups the ten of cups is the energy of happiness like ten it's the number ten right i would hold on my butt you know i got my hands anyways but <laughs> anyways the ten of cups is the best card you can get it means like total fulfillment total happiness this isn't the ten of cups this is almost ten of cups but not really this is one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight cups. This is eight cups, the eight of cups, right? So two more cups and you're there. So this person definitely did make you happy, but it's not enough. It's not enough. And um, right now, maybe you're feeling unbothered because look at that sun. He's like, whatever. And you're just, maybe that person's looking at you like, whatever, you can't do better than me. But, and you're like, no, you know what, whatever to you, I'm moving forward and I'm not dealing with this shit because I know who I am. I The king of pentacles is the energy of somebody that is very grounded, someone that know that it's the king, all right? The king is top notch, like balls deep, like God said, you know what I'm saying? Um, he got his money, look it, he's got that pentacle. He's got that money, he's in his throne, he's a motherfucking king. He's got his money, he's got his emotions, he's got his logic under control, you guys. So this is the energy that you need to embody, Scorpio. I'm sorry, you guys, that this is um this is how this is what you're going through, Scorpio. Um, I send you all good energy. You know, at the end of the day, let this let this shit go. There are so many people out there that you can meet, Scorpio, that are going to love you, that are going to treat you right. But, you know, you got to, like, do baby steps. you got to heal. I can't emphasize that as much, but heal, 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 heal so that the universe and God, whatever it is that you believe in, can, you know, you can be ready to be able to take this journey. You have to be ready. You can't expect to be happy and do all this if you yourself isn't ready if you aren't a hundred percent complete so scorpio i feel like that is the message for you right now it's crazy because that's what i was feeling and then what the cards came out okay um it's just you know it's hard you guys but definitely love yourself put yourself first scorpio I want to see you guys succeed. I want everybody to succeed. And and there's a recipe to succeed, you guys. Um, when it comes to love, you have to learn to love yourself first. Look. Love yourself. All right, Scorpio, that was your guys' reading. Um, I hope you guys are doing awesome. Keep your head up. Love you guys. Send you guys all my, all my love. Oh, actually, before I forget um, to like, I'll take out maybe one more card because you guys need one more card. Which deck? Which deck? All right. I'm going to take this deck um, and I'm going to do one Oracle card for you guys. And while I'm shuffling, if you guys want to go ahead, like and subscribe to my channel. Also, if you can go ahead and turn on the notification bell. Um, P.S. I upload every Friday and if you guys like the way that I read um, I do offer personal readings and I can get deeper than all this I'll leave all that information in the description I do 30 minute readings for $25 and yep you guys let's see what is the last card okay I feel like it's this one release you guys oh my gosh what did i say release retreat right you guys have to release release this energy you guys let it go let it go love yourselves you guys 
release it release that energy that hurt feel it don't ignore it feel the pain but don't get drowned in in the pain let it go release it you guys all right that was your guys's reading scorpio now i can say goodbye all right bye guys